everybody. Welcome to Sunday. It's January the 21st, 2018. It is 3.37 p.m. right now. I'm here at the house by myself other than Butch. He's laying over there snoring somewhere. Albert's ran to the shop to do a little work because it's been so cold. He ain't been able... His shop is so cold. So, he's... Lately, he can't handle the cold. I tell him it's because he's getting older. He don't like to hear that. But he complains, I don't know why I can't handle the cold. I used to handle the cold. <laughs> anyway, so he's not been working much in the shop on these cold, cold, cold days we've been having. So he's been home a lot. So today he ran over to the shop. It's kind of a pretty day, he said, and it's not as cold out. So he went to the shop to do a little bit of work. Elizabeth's at work, so I'm here by myself. Katie and them, they're at their house, you know. So anyway... Uh, I kind of feel bad. I have a really bad headache. I took some medicine, but it's still there gnawing at me. And so, anyway, I don't have any videos in my stock that I could put up today. And I know it's Sunday, and I used to not even worry about making videos on Sunday, but lately I've been putting videos up on Sunday. And so, I just feel lost, and, you know, I really want a video to put up today. <laughs> so... I decided to make this video so I could put it up today. <laughs> but it is, you know, it just popped in my mind. Because I was sitting there thinking, okay, now what kind of video could I make to put up today? And then it just hit me. And I said, hey, I'll do that. <laughs> okay. So, um, I hope that's not Albert driving up. I'm hearing car doors out there. Or anybody else. Could be Katie and them driving up too. You never know. <laughs> always interruptions. Always interruptions. Anyway. Okay. I want so bad to be able to make videos like a lot of y'all do, okay? When y'all are crafting, a lot of you have your video camera up above you looking down, but it's looking down not upside down. It's looking down right like the person crafting is looking down at it. So when you're watching the video, you see it that way also, the right way, not upside down. I want to do that so bad. I would really and truly love to do that so bad. But I have a, I don't know if all of y'all that do that are doing that with your cell phones that are clamped up some kind of way. I know my sister has some kind of clamp. She has hers in, or she used to anyway, Becca, the Becca JB. But anyway, uh, I actually have a camera, a little camcorder, and I have a tripod. Now, I have been keeping my camera on my tripod, and it, the legs close up, but they just have a little short legs. So, I set it up, like right now, it's sitting here in front of me on my table here. My table that I craft at and where my laptop is when I watch videos and stuff like that. Now, if I want to do something else every once in a while, but it's very seldom that I pull the legs all the way out and I have it standing up on the floor. But it's not a very big, tall, sturdy tripod. It's a flimsy one, okay? And it can be knocked over very easy. I don't really like that part about it. But anyway, it was the cheapest one I could afford at the time, which was years ago in Tennessee. Anyway, because I bought this when we was in Tennessee, didn't I? I think I did. So I've had it so long now, I don't remember. But anyway, so uh, now I do sometimes also take the camera off of the tripod, but that's also very seldom too. But what I have done is took a picture with my phone of my camera, because I want to show y'all my camera. Now, the thing about this, are y'all going to be able to see it good? So there is my camera. I've got it opened, so you see, that's the door. It opens. That closes in to my camera. But the little door, the screen, can also flip and turn around backwards. Okay. This, uh, <laughs> this, right here is the handle that black thing sticking out right there and I could grab a hold of that and I can tilt it 
up or down. So I can make it tilt all the way down towards my table. Standing there on my tripod. And y'all see the beginning, the top part of my three legs of my tripod there. Okay. So, and also, if you'll notice, it's, which y'all all probably know this, but it screws on right up here. So I can unscrew that and take the camera off of that. What I'd like to know, do y'all have any idea, is there any way, because I have tried, let me tell you this first, I have tried with the tripod first, I've tried opening it all the way out and setting it on my table and bending it down, and it's too far up for me to even look up to see it, to see if it's even aimed right. I want to do the close-ups when y'all are crafting. I want to craft like my crochet, and I would love to show y'all close-up me crocheting, and y'all be looking at it right and not upside down. Now, I have done it before. I've set it here to the side and pointed it down. Y'all have seen it that way. But I want it where it's right and not upside down. You understand what I mean? And... I don't want the, the start to say laptop, the tripod in my way either. Because I tried it last night. Sitting here all night, I turned it around, the tripod. I left it on its short legs. I tried it tall too. I tried it on the floor and pointing down. It's all in my way. And I can't handle that. Some of y'all might can do that. I know some people I've seen and they'd say, I'm working around. My hands are around the camera tripod doing it. And I think, oh my Lord, uh -uh, no way. I cannot do that. That would irritate me. Number one, it wouldn't take very few seconds and I would start to be hurting in my shoulders and neck the way I would have to hold and position myself to be able to do that. There's no way I could do that. So I need the camera out of my way. I would love to have it up above me like y'all do some way, somehow. And I cannot video with my camera. Yes, it makes little videos, but it makes short ones, not as long as I like to make my videos. And also, this phone is crazy. It'll do so much of a video or so many videos. It'll do, I'm, I'm surprised. I'm lucky it let me take this picture. I can take so many pictures. I don't understand what this is, is about it. But I can take so many pictures on my video and then it'll pop up and it'll say, can't take no more pictures. It's like it's full. But we have been in there. A lot of people has been in my phone and looked and checked. It is not full. They say I have plenty of whatever it is a cell phone has. Plenty of room and should be able to take more pictures and more videos. But it will stop and it will not. And I can even go in and delete the videos and pictures out of it, but it's still at that thing saying I can't take anymore. And you know what? I have to wait like two or three days, and then it's like somehow or another it clears it all, and then I'm able to do more videos and pictures again. It's weird. I don't understand it. So I cannot video with my camera for y'all. So don't be telling me, you know, do this and use your cell phone. It'd be a lot easier. I can't, okay? I want to be able to use my camera, this camera that I showed y'all on video, and um, kind of somehow hook it up, hang it up above me in the right position where y'all seeing it right, looking at it right, not upside down, to show and zoom in close to my work. Not just crocheting, but other crafting that I do. I want to be able to do that. I'd love to. So I'm hoping y'all can help me figure out a way to be able to do that because, and I need the camera not to be in my way. The tripod, I can't do that. I tried it last night. I started hurting. I couldn't. I made some little sample videos. I turned my camera facing me first. Like I, I normally do it sideways, but I tried doing it facing it and I tilted it down and I sat here and crocheted. For just a few minutes and then I stopped like I did two like I did three stitches okay so then I stopped and turned it off then I turned my camera around where it would be facing that away away from me but I tilted it down to the table and I had to put my arms around it and have my thread and my needle and I sat there and I did three more stitches like that video in that okay the, the little thing on my camera is also messed up I used to when I first bought it 
I used to be able to mash a button and see all the little clips that I had took on my camera and watch them here on here. Now I can't do that. I can't get to that place to do that. But that button is messed up. It's mashed in and it don't work. So I have to actually turn my camera off and I have to take the card out, put it in my laptop and pull the video up that way to watch it to see what it looks like. So I did that last night and I watched both videos. So the first one where the camera was facing me, well, pointed down but turned towards me, you know what I mean. Uh, that one, y'all would be seeing it upside down. So for y'all to see it right, I would have to turn it facing away from me and point it down and be able to go around it. And when I was doing that, I started hurting. And I can't do that. It needs to be a relaxing way, a better way. Please, somebody, some way. This, the camera screws off, okay? And if I ain't mistaken, I've seen a lot of people, I think Becca may even have one. These little long, what do they call them? Selfie sticks? And they've bought one, and it's for a cell phone. They've bought one at Dollar Tree. But it seemed like, if I ain't mistaken, someone has told me and even showed that it has the little hookup to where this camera... Because it's just like a little metal screw thing, and it screws on there. That's the, the turn. I should have did it better. But somewhere or another, it's setting down... Y'all probably know what I'm talking about on a little screw thing there. And don't those things have that? Wouldn't I be able to unscrew my camera from the tripod, screw it onto that little thing if we could figure out some way to hang up the tripod, not the tripod, the little selfie stick out here so I could actually have it up here pointing down at me and zoom in and, and do it that way? Y'all let me know. Please, please, please. I'd really appreciate it. I wish there was some way I'd be able to do that. I want to do that so bad and make videos like that so bad. Okay? So, y'all let me know in the comments below. And I'd really appreciate it. And uh, give me ideas. Let me know where I can buy something that would work. Let me know how I could hang it up, tie it up, whatever. I'd appreciate it. Because I really want to do that. That's what I want to do. Alright. So... Okay, that's all I have for you. So, and I'm glad I got it done before Albert got back home. <laughs> Alright, so, I'm gonna go. Excuse me. I'm out of here until next time I'm done, I'm going to Lou.